Hi, I'm Devika Kumar. My name is London Camp Boykin. My name is John Wolf. I'm Subashree. My name is Austin Wright Pettibone. And I'm a Senior Engineering Technical Program Manager. I am a Senior Design Program Manager. I'm Director of Worldwide Real Estate Global Realty Development. I'm the Senior Manager for Product within Worldwide Real Estate Technology. And I head up Worldwide Real Estate Technologies here at Amazon. The Worldwide Real Estate Engineering team owns the building design criteria and design standards for Amazon's warehouses globally. We work with teams all across the company in order to figure out what are their most pressing business problems and how can technology help them solve things that they may not even know is a problem. We're doing workflow automation, we're doing geospatial capabilities, and we're doing artificial intelligence machine learning to allow the organization to do what they do today, but to do it better, faster, and cheaper. When I think about what's special about worldwide real estate technology, I think it's our ability to form connections across so many different parts of worldwide operations. If you're a person who does not like static work and enjoy being up for challenges, you love solving puzzles, then you're in the right place. It's a friends like family um, support system and a culture that has kept me glued to Amazon for the last few years. But it's also about diverse and inclusive representation and making sure that everyone gets to bring their best self to work every day. Again, it's a very uh, safe space. It's a very open culture. Everybody is ready to learn. And at the end of the day, it's not so much about the technology we're building, it's about the people we're connecting, the lives that we're impacting. I really can genuinely say we've put together an incredible team. I'm super excited about our ability to use geography to reimagine what the world could look like for Amazon's built environment. It's an exciting space to be in. It's exciting to see the roadmap and impact that we're going to be able to have in not just the months, but the years ahead of us.